All right, folks, Billy Blades here at the Blades headquarters. We got a little sneak peek for you. Go ahead and press play, Dave. This is our predator body. This first body is going to Mark Nash. This is our first predator here. And hours and hours and hours of work went into just what you're seeing right here, folks. This is no joke. We couldn't find anybody in the industry to help us. Everybody just wants to build strats and they want to just press a button on something that was designed back in the 50s because they have no brains, but we like to do things our way. So what you see now is a tool cutting out the wood in multiple passes. It's going down in steps. You don't want to chunk too much wood out or it'll tear it up. Tear the tool up and tear the machine up. But this is how we do it our way, folks. 16 hours of work just on this back alone, just to get it to this point. And we got to get a good props out to our buddy Shannon Sands. What's up, Shannon? Shannon rocks. Shannon does his own designs. We're going to be building for him, too, because he's got an awesome line of guitars and we're going to be helping him produce those things. So, Shannon did the CAD work for our Blades designs. I sent him over the pictures and he drew them up on CAD for us. He's a master. So, here you go. Here's the machine doing some of the 3D contouring. We're going to be loading this up into our CNC next week. I just want to give you guys a sneak peek. Building awesomeness at Blades. Right, Dave? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What do you think, Dave? It looks pretty damn cool, huh? Yeah, I'm just ready for it to hit the machine. Me too, man. I'm looking at the contouring. It's awesome how it just previews everything. This, folks, is a $2,000 program right here, Aspire. This is no joke. We're working with Corel Draw, SketchUp, and Aspire. And this thing is just magnificent. Learning automation really went ahead and set me free because I have so many ideas. This really set us up for some really cool ideas for upcoming products. Not only in the guitar world, but other products too. So stay tuned for some cool stuff. We're going to be doing our Blades tattoo machines. We're going to be just doing some custom mirrors with some exotic frames. We're going to be doing the neck contour for the 3D surface there. Angle neck pockets rock. It's more comfortable. It's got the holes in there. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to spin it around for you guys. Just to see a little bit of the contouring. Check that out. 3D, baby. Blades ain't fucking around. We get the shit done. Now we apologize to some of our people because we've been taking so long. But when we went ahead and first started to do this, we were looking for other companies to help us out with the OEM. To do some of the help, you know, do some of the machine work for us. But... They couldn't help us. A lot of people, they just want to do the standard strats and telecasters because it's easy. They already bought a program and they just put their piece of wood in and click the easy button. And then you got people. And I mean, I'm not really knocking them because I love the Stratocaster and Telecaster designs. But how many of them can you take with different names on them all the time? And then they want to charge four grand, five, six grand for a Strat or Telecaster. And really, it's getting monotonous. It's just getting so fucking stale man it's like stale bread you want fresh bread on your sandwich or do you want stale bread you want fresh lunch meat or do you want stringy stale wet nasty lunch meat right you want the fresh coolness man we're bringing you the new hotness fuck the old and bust it check that angle neck pocket out yep it's gonna cut out just like that it's gonna have minimal hand finishing too I mean, it's got the contours around here and softening of the edges we got the tremolo pocket got the shelf for the control cavity for the upper switch i love my switches where the less paul is because i love to do like a stutter effect you get that eh, 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 eh. <laughs> just love it look at that man perfection took us so many hours just to get to this point this body alone has probably 60 hours of work involved in it. We haven't even cut the first one. I could have done all this by hand, but frankly, honest, you know, be honest with your folks. It's kind of hard when you got a family and you're running 
couple businesses and you, know, you got a kid and you don't want to be spending your Sundays in a garage sweating over some wood. You know, that's why we built the machine. You know, we couldn't find anyone else to help us. And, and we want perfection every time. So CNC is the way to go. I mean, it's all nice and fine and dandy to cut them out by hand. But that's okay if you want to be 80 years old and be Geppetto in your, in your workshop whittling wood when you're 90 or 80, you know. But we want to get shit done, man. I want to be vacationing when I'm that old. I don't want to be fucking around people's wood. I want to have a shop full of employees doing it for me. <laughs> right, Dave? You're going to be the boss of them all. Hell yeah. Yeah, look at that, man. Just giving you guys a sneak peek. Checking it out. Hope you like. Hope you enjoy. This is what's to come. And we got more on the way. This is just the rear of the body. I'll flip it over. You see the front isn't even done yet. That's still got to be G-coded. But right now, we got about a dozen programs here. A dozen G-code programs just to get to this level here. Because each thing is a separate operation. First, you've got to cut the outline, the 3D surfaces, all the pockets. Each one of these is its own individual little pocket. So, just want to give you guys a sneak peek. Hope you enjoy. Real things coming soon. This is just the next step on the chain, next step in the ladder. So, here we go, folks. Enjoy. I hope you all have a great day out there in Toneland. Know that Blades is kicking ass for you, and you all have a great day. Talk soon. Have a good one. See ya.